My definition of a pioneer would be um, someone who's been one of the first to do it, a trailblazer, someone who didn't really have someone like themselves necessarily doing what they were doing. And is really looking to create a path for people coming after them. Going through the adversity and, and everything that, that's going to be presented in your path in order to, to achieve something that's really special. Playing what's typically been known as a, a male sport automatically makes any woman who plays it somewhat of a pioneer. Um, going in and playing in a team sport that was once an individual sport kind of allows you all to take on that role together. It's interesting because you don't understand that you're a, what a pioneer is until you're kind of in that experience yourself. And you don't understand it until you've gone through that. And once I left USF and had so much care for what we'd ha we had done, I then started to understand, well, wow, this now makes me feel even more connected to the girls that came before me, the women that came before me. All I was doing was playing the game that I loved and for the joy of it, for no other reason. I hope that any athlete that has, you know, looked to me in any kind of way, I hope that they just remain fearless. That it's good to have people who do great things because they raise the bar and then others know that they can do it as well. It drove us to be together and to say we can make this work as a group and we have to be empowered by each other. So even though you're constantly in a level of competition in any sport, you're also inspiring each other and you're, you're making this knit of just beautiful community. We're not done yet and we the student athletes we have now, they can be the pioneers. And that's really an exciting place for me to coach from, is that, yes, we've accomplished some great things at USF, at Oregon, at Cal, but um, there's still a ways to go and there's still an opportunity to be a pioneer in this very day.